Reading. Don't be a victim of emotional blackmail. Emotional blackmailers include four main groups: punishers, self-punishers, sufferers, and tantalizers. Emotional blackmailers from any group may spin the problem to make it seem like the other person's fault. A punisher threatens to punish others if their demands are refused. Self-punishers threaten to harm themselves to make the other person feel they have to help them. Sufferers make it seem like the other person can solve their problems. They may cry to make the other person feel guilty. Tantalizers pose threats as quid pro quo, such as "If you do this thing for me, I'll do something nice for you." It seems like a gift, but the cycle keeps repeating with more and more demands. How can you bring emotional blackmail to an end? Firmly express your boundaries. You have the right to say no. You can also try talking to the person to solve the problem. Also, a capable therapist can assist you with all these approaches. If nothing works, it's best to walk away from the relationship.